Okay, Houston, right, we've had a problem here. This is Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. We've had a main B plus Thunderbolt. Roger, main B Thunderbolt. Okay, stand by at 13, we're looking. to say earth is flat jack flatter than a flapjack we about to flat smack globers get your backpack i'm with my flat pack globes in the trash sack as a or equidistant map upon my snapback flat smack and everybody at joe's crab shack looking at us like what we're saying is so abstract lesson one no curvature there to be found how can it be a ball if nothing about it is round lesson two three quarters of the ground is covered in flat water do you hear the way that sounds lesson three take a look at the stars that you see at night same constellations that you've been seeing for all your life you can straight up see the wires and the green screen glitches and the water bubbles floating on the spacewalk missions it's detestable i refuse to be another vegetable pseudoscience garbage will to me be unacceptable anyone with eyes to see don't have to be susceptible dispose of your globe in the nearest waste receptacle we backpacking absurdities they taught to us as facts as the nursery courtesy of a sun worshiping fraternity you heard of flat earth but didn't know it was the truth they announced to the entire world that the u.s was going to the moon <laughs> We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other thing. Huh. Seven years later, in 1969, the Apollo 11 mission did just that. Today, NASA is planning another trip to the moon, and they hope to be there by no later than the mid-2020s. Stop praying about it. Shut up and wait. Go work on you here. That's what that time is for to get yourself together. I'd rather be in a corner by myself with a puppy and a goldfish and be happy than to be sitting around with somebody in my house. I'm wondering what the hell they there for. You would be surprised the things people put up with just to have somebody to say they love them. That's I don't understand. I, I can't live in this function. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I done come through too much, been through too much hell and high water to come there and let you come up in my adult life and where I'm supposed to be at peace and give me all kind of hell. Only two places on this earth you're going to have peace, the grave and your house. Now, if you can't walk up in your house and you ain't got no peace, something wrong. Something wrong. I'm sorry. But I guarantee you that you don't actually know what we believe. And if you let yourself watch to the end with an open mind, you'll find out that it's actually you that's been hanging on a belief system on a religion as it relates to the globe. The loom and the rover and you and, and uh, Stone Mountain and the old flag. Come on out here and give me a salute. Big Navy salute. Off the ground. Number three from Apollo 17, astronauts singing, skipping, dancing. I was strolling on the moon one day in a very, very month of December. Now, May, May. I like to skip along, but me, boy, skip. Number four, this is astronaut Jack Schmidt. This is astronaut Jack Schmidt getting frustrated. No, that coming. Jack Schmidt having a few problems. I'd go to the moon in a nanosecond. Uh, the problem is we don't have the technology to do that anymore. We used to, but we uh, destroyed that technology, and uh, it's a paper process to build because we didn't go there and we didn't go there and because we didn't go there and
And that's the way it happened. And, and if it didn't happen, it's nice to know why it didn't happen. Okay, you're going to have a problem here. Mrs. Houston, say again, please. Oh, uh, you're going to have a problem. We've had a main beep on Butterball. Roger, main beep. Nerd, what? Did you? Nerd, what? Did you? Okay, here, we've had a problem here. Mrs. Houston, say again, please. Uh, here, we've had a problem. 